In this video, we're going to collect logs for TMS and TMS XE using the TMS web interface and the TMS log collection utility. To collect logs for TMS and TMS PE, navigate to the TMS web interface and go to Administrative Tools, TMS Server Maintenance. From here, under TMS Diagnostics, select Download Diagnostic Files. Depending on your browser setup, you may get a prompt to save the file. This collects logs for both TMS and TMS PE at the same time. If you're unable to reach the TMS web interface, the logs can be collected from the TMS install folder. Contact your TAC engineer for further direction there. For TMS XE, we need to RDP into the server hosting the TMS XE application. This may be the TMS server itself. For large deployments, this is going to be located on a separate Windows server. Open the Start menu, then open the TMS Log Collector utility. To collect the logs for TMS XE, click Export TMS XE Log. A prompt will ask you where to save the logs, and then you can upload these to your TAC engineer for analysis. If you download the log collector, it will work with any version of TMS 15.0 or newer, or TMS XE 5.0 or newer. If you don't have the TMS log collector tool, you can download it from the Cisco.com website. To locate the tool, go to Cisco.com and go to Support and Downloads, click All Products, click Conferencing, Scroll down and click TMS Management Suite. Click on Download Software. Then click on the TMS Management Suite Log Collection Utility. Download whatever the latest version is. At the time of this video, it's 1.0.0. The TMS Log Collector tool is included in all TMS install packages from 15.8 onwards. If you have a clustered deployment, also run the log collector on the clustered server and upload that log bundle as well. And those are the basic ways to collect the TMS and TMSXE logs and download the log collector utility. I hope this video helps and thank you for watching.